Hi there, I'm going to bring you this game I've just played on chess.com and my opponent is 1918 for Blitz Chess, 3 minute and my accuracy is 85% or according to their engine and my opponent's accuracy is 75% so I'm going to bring you this game and I'm going to go through the whole uh, game with you should be about only 10 minutes long something like that I'm going to bring this game to you and I'm going to go through the computer's analysis on the review of the game so that's what I'm going to do okay so I hope you like this hope you get something from this and I hope I do too I almost spooked my second cup of coffee again today again I'm probably going to put that wee skit of the video that I was recording earlier this week on as a short where I'm just where I spilt my coffee over my keyboard and over my computer table and all that sort of stuff and I let out a bit of a so let's begin here and you're going to hear what the computer has to say about my first move e3 so here we go e3 okay e3 oh no it's done the plat i don't want it to do that i want it to just go let me play it, okay it's still doing it okay oh, i'm just have to work out how to stop it Okay, I've worked it out. So I'm very new to this. E3. First of all, the review is you saw your chance to win. You sorry, you saw your chance for the win and you took it. And so my opponent is clearly from a Norwegian player versus New Zealand. You saw your chance for the win and you took it. I'm gonna open my curtain. Because I've actually got it shut, believe it or not. Okay, I'm not going to pause. You get to see me real time. If I spill this coffee, though, you won't. I won't. Oh, there you go. <laughs> that lights up. But it also lights up my screen. Okay, but I can see it on there. So you saw your chance for the win and you took it. That's the overall game review. Okay. So we're going to go see if I can go just go here like this. E3 is a book move, plus 0.09. E3 is a weak first move that doesn't do enough to control the center. Okay, I can take these off. I don't need these on. Quite me myself up a bit. I think I can read it. Okay, so E3 is a weak first move that doesn't do enough to control the center. E5 is the last book move. And now it's 0 0.5, 0.12. I won't go into that detail much more after this. E5 takes space in the center, controls the D4 and the F4 squares and allows the queen and dark squared bishop to develop. Yeah, that's kind of like a little bit sort of practical. And D4 is the best move. Your bishop is ready to be developed to an active square. This is an equal trade, ED4, and it's a good move for black. ED4 is my best move um, for white, recapturing their piece, which not a piece, it's a pawn. D5 is best. This prepares the bishop for development. Uh, F4 is a mistake. You ignored an opportunity to develop a knight off to a starting square. To its starting square. That's my eyes. I might put the glasses back on. So, if you bear with me, it might actually be a little bit longer than... So, what I might do is... I might just go through these moves a little bit quicker. Knight F3 is the best. Uh, saying something about... You followed, a, I want to read this. You followed a great, 
you followed a great chess principle and developed a new piece, which is very important, of course. Whereas Knight C6 is just good. It's not like my one was the best. And this develops the Knight off its getting an interaction. Okay, right now. Some reason. Bishop D3 is good. Uh, knight B4 is good. It's not a mistake, but it's not the best move either. Because, first of all, black's moving twice in the opening. So castle is okay. Knight D3, Queen D3. It now sits at minus 35 in... Um, is that um, black's favour, isn't it? Minus 0.35. Queen d3 was best. Bishop e7 uh, activates the bishop. c3. I should have um, played knight c3 according to the computer. Castling is the best move. Knight e5 is okay, but not what I would have played. Knight d7 is a mistake. So my opponent is giving me equal opportunity. Um... Here, I went knight d2. Okay. You can see what the good moves are. This threatens um, bishop d7 and bishop b5. Uh, I kind of ignore it for the meantime, but not now. Now I play rook f2, uh, a4, b5, a5, rook f2 as bishop b5 was threatened to take my rock or my queen. So I went rook f2, bishop b5, my opponent's playing all the right moves, queen d7's the, the best move, so I get it out of the way because I don't want to lose my queen and I don't want to really swap off. This is the best move again. This is an accuracy only, so I won't go into it. Oh, phone's ringing. It's alright, rook f3 is no good. h4 is no good. What was the only good move here? You moved quickly, missing the old, the only good move, which was rook to f1, I see, yes, okay. Now, how is that so good? Rook f1, what's so special about that? Might be going to play um, rook f6 if my opponent allows it and um, play h4 and h5 and rook h3 and queen h6 stuff like that maybe I don't know something like that so my the bar good's gone down a bit there this is no good either and I don't play queen f6 here I play h5 oh that's the best move Another inaccuracy. What's wrong with this move? Uh, what do they recommend here for me? They recommend Queen back to F4 instead. Great. Best move. Yay, another one. Great. The best move is rook a4. Wow. Rook b4 is okay, but uh, e6 is better. Yeah, I should go on rook b7. Okay. 
King F6 was best. Rook G7 is the best move. And of course, that's the best move for black. I get a wee bit fumbly with the ball. I was thinking of playing G4. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking my opponent should play Rook E2 here. Yeah, this move here. Rook E2, check. I thought that's the better move, I thought. Uh, however, King G8 was okay. Rook E3, swap please. Nope. Rook E4 was best. So this is an accurate. D3 is an accurate. As now I've got a simple win. Yeah. I played rook h8 and h7 is okay. What's the better move? Ah, oh, rook g7 is, but I wanted to uh, win with the queen. Okay, that's that game. I hope you like that game. Uh, this move still leads to checkmate, but you had a way to get there faster. Threatening that pin piece is going to win you material. And checkmate in three moves. Okay, cheers.